I'm Rich Noonan for World Business Watch, a program in which we look at companies that are changing our world. Today, Advanced Fluid Systems, one of America's great fluid power firms with a reputation for being able to do just about anything. Whether it's a small job or helping a company launch a rocket into space, the name is Advanced Fluid Four, Systems. Three, Go in, Taurus. One. The test launch of this rocket into space went off without a hitch. Future launches will be used to deliver payloads to the International Space Station. The image of this modern marvel was especially significant for the team at Advanced Fluid Systems, which designed, built and installed critical hydraulic and computer motion control systems for this project. It was a four-year odyssey for a small but very special company, with two locations in Pennsylvania and one in Maryland. In fact, it appeared that many other companies wanted no part of the so-called rocket job because they knew it would be tough. The reason that customer found Advanced Fluid Systems is because Advanced has a stellar reputation for quality and innovation. But having a team of NASA engineers looking over their shoulders for this project was something new. Every valve, every cylinder, every sensor, every, everything on the control system had to be evaluated if this fails for whatever reason what happens to the system. Thankfully, nothing did fail. Advanced Fluid Systems built the controls for the huge rocket lift and launch for track system. In layman's terms, the hydraulic muscle and computer brains to lift the rocket and then retract the gantry really fast to get it out of the way as the rocket lifted off. Not an easy job. The entire process of the rapid retract is to get the tail out of the way and to pull all the umbilicals out of the rocket, the electrical and the air conditioning umbilicals. We have to go from the two degree pre-pulled back position to 15 degrees. The tail, keep in mind, the tail weighs 152,000 pounds or more. So we have to move that mass 13 degrees from two degrees to 15 degrees in approximately 2.4 seconds. If the team at Advanced Fluid Systems was nervous watching this on launch day, you'd never know it. They are very experienced engineers after all, problem solvers. Chief Engineer Larry Quickle says, despite hundreds and hundreds of pages of documentation required for NASA engineers, intense scrutiny by those engineers, and in some cases, triple redundancy systems, he actually enjoyed the rocket job and having NASA looking over his shoulder. As it turned out, we weren't called on anything, and they absolutely scrutinized the control system. We had a lot of compliments come from both NASA, Mars, and the independent contractors that they brought in to do inspections. Larry says despite the fact that Advanced Fluid Systems was a small firm doing a big job, he was given everything he needed to do that job right. Yeah, I, I had all the backing I could, have, I could have ever expected from anybody. That backing came from Jim Vaughn, who founded Advanced Fluid Systems many years ago. We're all engineers. We're not, uh, we're not uh, owned by a larger company that's driven by profit. Uh, unfortunately, I don't look at profit, I look at advancement and development. And as long as it's uh, going in the right direction, I'm happy, you know. And uh, we are going in the right direction. Advanced Fluid Systems has been very profitable, but not because of the big jobs like this one. Its bread and butter consists of jobs much smaller than the rocket project. We do so many different applications for different customers of all different scales. and. You know, what I like to tell people is we're a problem-solving company. You know, we're really an engineering company. Um, I get them secondhand, but I love sitting in our Monday morning managers meeting and hear them talk about, yeah, we came up with a new idea, and they loved it. And a lot of times it's for a company that's been doing this application for, for 50 years. And we came to them with an idea that they'd never thought of before. Advanced Fluid Systems, its feet firmly planted on the ground despite the biggest challenge in its history. These guys just sometimes worked around the clock. And on the, on the uh, NASA facility, I mean, they would be down there for months at a time. We, matter of fact, rented a condominium at the NASA location where our people were just living for months at a time and it comes under the realm of advanced fluid systems. We'll do whatever it takes to get the project done. Remember that the next time you need some high quality fluid power for that little machine or that big rocket headed out of this world. The name is Advanced Fluid Systems. For World Business Watch, I'm Rich Noonan. We'll see you next time.